Number four is constant reinforcements. Now, I know this one is an annoying one, okay? Because I know I hate repeating myself. <laughs> me repeating myself? If you ain't hear me the first time, I don't know. I'm the type of person, y'all. This video is even for music. I'm the type of person, if I say it one time and you ain't hear me, if I gotta say it again, I ain't gonna say it again. You just ain't gonna hear from me again. It's just that simple. I'm very, I'm a firm believer in cutting people off. <laughs> Don't gotta set boundaries with old friends if you can get new ones. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm just saying. Don't gotta set boundaries with old friends. If you could just get new ones. Period. I'm just saying. Okay. But yes, reinforcements is very important because unfortunately, people are not gonna get it the first time around. They're not gonna get it the second time around. They're probably not even gonna get it the third time around. They're probably not even gonna get it the fourth time around. Who knows when they're gonna get it? They're gonna get it one day, but the chances of them getting it the first few times are very slow. I mean, very slow, or very slim, very slim chances. So don't even go into these conversations with people. And even if they understand it, everything goes smooth sailing, or maybe they don't understand and it, it the conversation go left, but they come back and they apologize. They go, you know what? I see where you're coming from and I understand you and I'm going to respect your boundaries. Don't think that that's going to be the last time y'all have that conversation because you're going to disappoint yourself right there. And you're going to give up on setting boundaries if you disappoint, if you disappoint yourself thinking that all I do is got to have this one conversation with them and that's going to be done. No. Humans are a creature of habits, okay? And some people, like I said, have a habit of treating people a certain type of way, which is why you have to teach people how to treat you. Because once they get in the habit of treating you a certain type of way, they're going to feel comfortable and okay with treating you a certain type of way. It's just that simple. So that's why when you are trying to set boundaries in relationships, you know, especially the longer the relationship has been, um, it will be much harder in my eyes. You just have to understand that even if they fall back in line to what they used to do, which is crossing over certain boundaries, it's not even intentional. They are just being a creature of habit and you just have to have the patience to remind them, hey, we had this conversation. This is where I draw the line. It's starting to cross it a little bit. I'm gonna need you to back up. Just plain and simple, okay? And there's nothing wrong with that if you got the patience for it. Because like I said, you don't gotta set boundaries with old friends if you can get just simply get new ones. And you can always get new friends, baby. A new friend, a new boyfriend, a new mama, for crying out loud. You can always... <laughs> Anyways, let's move on. Last